Good morning, Forest Park. Today is June 23rd, 2021. I'm Don Jones. I'm the city manager here in Forest Park. And I have with me today Chief Alfie Jones, who's the chief of our fire department. And I wanted to get him here today to talk a little bit about fireworks. It's the holiday season. It's beginning. The 4th of July is the next one. And then we've got several coming up throughout the rest of the year. So I wanted to get him here to talk about fireworks and uh, the dangers, the legality, and uh, give us a little update on fireworks in Forest Park. Thank you, Don. And uh, looking at fireworks safety, uh, I, I hate to use both words at the same, same meaning at the same time because there's no way safely for unprofessionals like ourselves to do fireworks. I, I always say, let the professionals do the fireworks. Uh, so with that being said, uh, the, the, the fireworks that we do purchase will be in the Kroger's or your, your local grocery stores. These are the legal versions. So those are your barklers, smoke bombs, and I think there's something like little snakes that you like. As a, as a child, I recall that. So those are the type of fireworks that are allowed in the state of Ohio. Even with the sparkler, uh, those are very dangerous. If, if you're using, utilizing those, for, even with little kids, these are made of metals. Uh, so when you light it, metals burn very hot. So with little kids, we need to make sure that their eyes are protected and they probably need some kind of covering for their arms because it will burn them. Um, with all the other fireworks that we utilize, make sure that we have a bucket of water nearby. So when the device is over with, we put it in the water and it, it smothers it out. But uh, going to the fireworks as we go to our neighbors of purchase, neighboring states, uh, of course, these are illegal to be used in the state of Ohio, but if you do utilize them, please practice safety with these. I mean, distancing, st if you light one at a time, keep people away from the devices and allow them to fire. Uh, bottle rockets are not made for bottle ro rocket wars. We don't want to shoot these at each other. So uh, I'm recalling from my past, but this is before anyone educated me on firework safety. But uh, make, make sure we're shooting these directly up in the sky and also having your water a source of a, a can of water or garden hose. So I, I know over the years that we've had fires that were started with fireworks uh, as they were launched into the sky and they landed on the top of roofs. So I know of two. And so we want to be practice safety here. And one of the biggest things I want to bring up is that if you do use these commercial made fireworks, please clean up your mess. Every year, the city of Forest Park spends a lot of money on our public Thousands works. Thousands of dollars. Yes, just to clean up the garbage. So please, spray it down with water and take it with you. Um, so looking at fireworks with the loud sounds, protect the hearing of our pets. Our pets have very sensitive hearing. And these fireworks are loud booms. We all know this. And, and it, it'll disturb a dog. You can have them go into a cardiac type of event. Um, at that level. Be mindful of our soldiers who have returned back from combat, who are experiencing PTSD. Uh, this could be a triggering mechanism. So we need to be mindful of shooting these uh, and utilizing these devices in, in the neighborhood. Well, that's important. That, that's a real important thing you're, you're, you're bringing up there, Alfie, because the, um, a lot of folks, you know, they go out and they just got their family around them. And they think, well, we're just going to go out and shoot off some fireworks and have some fun. But um, they forget about their neighbors. And remember, we live in a, you know, in a, in a community where, you know, where, where houses are right next to each other. You're not out in the farm where you can throw them out and, and blast them away without bothering anybody. So you got to be mindful of your neighbors, mindful of your pets, mindful of your kids, too, because a lot of kids are really definitely afraid of those loud noises. And um, so I think that's a real important Point. Maybe go out and talk to your neighbor before you let them know what you're going to be doing. Um, I know last year I spent the morning um, cleaning my car, you know, and, and wiping off the the burn stains off of the paint, and uh, and hope that the uh, that the bottle rockets didn't burn the condo cover on my truck. So, you know, yeah, I could have moved it out of the way if I'd known they were going to be shooting them. So the point is, you know, maybe talk with your neighbors before you do anything like this. But again, remember, they are illegal. It'll be difficult for the police department to monitor the illegal activity of utilizing fireworks. You increase your chances of being cited if you become injured. So please be careful. Utilize the fireworks coming out of your, uh, your media, like the Walmarts, the Meyer, and the uh, Kroger. So utilize those devices. Secondly, no fire, fire gun, fire, uh, firearms. Do not fire weapons in the sky. 
This, this is troubling to hear that this continues to happen year round. Keep the firearms in the house for your personal security. These are not toys to celebrate. In closing, be mindful of the time. If, if you can close off the fireworks at nine or 10 o'clock at night, that would be wonderful. Do your neighbors like to sleep? Some work third shift, first shifts, they need their sleep. So be mindful of the, the community. And I know with the, 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 the holiday season approaching us, I'll be one to say that there at least will be one major injury in the tri-state area from using commercial made fireworks. So stay from over top of the devices. Do not lean over and make sure that when you light, lean over and light and let it to launch. If it does not launch, soak it down water and then stay away from it. Uh, these, are, these are like explosives, uh, low grade type explosives. So be mindful of this. It, it will take limbs and it will take a life and it has happened last year. So please be careful. Uh, your best bet is to go to a professional show. They'll be located on any type of website or any of the, the, uh, multi, the media outlets will give you advice where these shows are. And, and this will be your safest way of enjoying the holiday. Exactly. So if you're, uh, if you're going to use fireworks, use the legal ones and uh, be safe with whatever you do and make sure that uh, you're aware of your pets and your kids and your neighbors and basically just respect um, your community and respect uh, your neighbors and have a really good time, but don't turn it into a tragedy that, uh, that uh, you'll regret for your life and maybe the, you know, some of your friends and neighbors' lives as well. Be safe, Forest Park, and have a good, have a good fourth.